three, two, one. Let's go. Now, Queen Elizabeth in 1992 said it was a endless, or horrible year. But could this year arrive with it? Think of every winter scandal you know involving the House of Windsor. Charles and Camilla, Diana's anguish, Sarah Ferguson's toe-sucking scandal. What ever happened in one comes this year? 1992 is not a year on which I will look back with undiluted pleasure, said the Queen. She rasped on the day of her ruby jubilee before clearing her throat. In the words of one of my more sympathetic correspondents, it has turned out to be an annus horribilis. 1992, for me, was a horrible year, said the Queen. After decades of exemplary scandal-free service, the Queen keenly aware 12 catastrophic months had put her record under threat. Now, recent scandals involving the royal family, the rift between William and Harry, Prince Andrew, has marred the Jubilee, but we shall have a happy Putnam Jubilee. I wish you, Your Majesty, a happy Putnam Jubilee. No institution, city, monarchy, whatever, should expect to be free from scrutiny of those who give their loyalty and support, not to mention those who don't, the Queen said. Disorder questioning can also act, and it should do so, as an effective engine for change. It is also a stunning plea for kindness and a vow to reform an ancient institution, and it came from Her Majesty, a woman who spent much of her life walked by in the monarchy as a pillar of British life, through traditional, tradition and national norms. The Queen is our mainstay. The Queen is the anchor to HMS Victory. HMS Victory. The two Nelsons. Nelson Mandiba, Nelson Mandela, and Nelson Trafalgar. HMS Victory. We know, we, we, all of us, right, we might not be all in the same boat, rowing in the same boat. We're all part of the same street fleet. Yeah. The people, individuals and individual families going about their business, trying to do their best in life. And our queen is head of state. Leader of the Freemasons. Leader of the police, the force, the queen is our anchor, our go-to point. She's seen, the queen has seen many, many prime ministers come and go. The only mainstay there is the civil service, which is under control of her majesty. Don't forget it's HM government, they are elected officials. We elected them. We hold the power, not the politicians. They made the decisions to make legislation and bills, but we hold the power with our vote, our vital voter view. Put it in the ballot box, one person, one vote. Culminate, get all these votes together, Count them all up. Who's got the most votes? Wins. HM government, Her Majesty's government, the Queen's speech. She opens Parliament. She closes Parliament. The Queen is our mainstay, our anchor to HMS victory. Victory in all fronts. We must talk Thatcherism. We must talk Churchillism. Why do people vote Conservative? A horrible year and people still voting conservative i'll tell you why 
because the people would like to be lorded over lorded over yeah the conservatives are the most successful party and yeah they're the most successful party and they uphold tradition and national norms tradition and national norms and that's what we all want and that's why we respect the queen the mainstay the anchor of hms victory the mainstay of great Britain, the go-to point of great Britain. that's why we all respect her majesty the queen national norms and tradition happy Platinum jubilee I end on that point national norms and tradition we need the monarchy they don't need us they could have left us years ago they've amassed so much money over thousands of years since the beginning since, since the birth of great Britain, the kings and queens ancient monarchy have amassed so much wealth they don't need to be in a gilded cage. But I'll end on that point. National norms and tradition. The Queen is the go to point. For national norms and tradition. Thank you. Have a happy Jubilee. I wish Your Majesty, Lords, Ladies, Mayor, City of London, Members of Parliament, the Lords, the Conservative Party, the Labour Party and the Opposition. I wish you a happy Platinum Jubilee. As I said, I'll end on that point. I went on for a little bit more ranting and raving. Excuse the ranting, excuse the raving. I don't mean it. Mood, it varies. National norms and tradition. I'm Mark. From me and mine to you and yours. Have a happy Platinum Jubilee. Peace. One planet, one humanity, one love. I'm out. Peace.